How did Bun B become financially free? We're gonna talk about that in this video. Starting with some background, legendary trill artist Bun B, born Bernard Freeman, is a Houston artist who influenced the game and made some great investments along the way. Bun B was half of the group UGK or Underground Kings with Pimp C, RIP Pimp C. UGK rose to fame in 1992 for the skills they are praised for today. Bun B did have some solo work, but after the sad death of Pimp C in 2007 is when Bun B was fully solo. From then to now, we have seen many investments from Bun B to set himself up outside of music. Going into music, Bun B is very adamant about artists learning the business of music to help grow the brand. Bun B does own his music, including publishing, which will continue to be a great source of income. On UGK, the duo had three albums sell over 500,000 copies, with the 1996 album Ride and Dirty selling over 800,000 copies. All albums released in UGK sold over 200,000 copies. Those numbers represent the influence that UGK with Pimp C and Bun B had over the industry. That is what builds up the legendary status in the empire that Bun B is building now. As a solo artist, Bun B has released over 8 albums with those albums having pretty consistent sales. Growing this music empire is what led him to build in other industries which I I am looking forward to talk about. Bumby is now releasing music independently, which makes the numbers he receives even better. In the past, Bumby has been on Rap A Lot Records, Jive Records, Motown Records, and more. With the sales that UGK brought, Bumby was able to continue to leverage his way up into better deals, eventually being better off independent. Overall, when it comes to music, Bumby owning his music has been a massive income stream with the album sales himself and UGK received. This creates opportunities throughout his career to grow in the business world, which I am most excited to talk about. Going into investing, Bun B has trusted himself to build up the Trill brand for decades now, which in turn built trust among the brand. Recently, Bun B opened his own restaurant brand, Trill Burgers, which was launched in July 2021. The reason why I classify this as just a brand is because there is no physical location yet for the company. Trill Burgers partners with the restaurant, Sticky's Chicken to have different pop-up shops throughout the past year. The Trill Burger brand focuses on the famous Smash Burger formula, which is very popular today. What is great about having consistent pop-up shops is that Bumby can focus on building a customer base and make the improvements necessary to launch a successful restaurant. Definitely looking forward to seeing how this will continue to develop. The most recent pop-up shop was this month, May 2022. Bumby has built the Trill brand into the ventures he runs, but understands how to bring the quality to bring in customers. This is how he built multiple revenue streams through the Trill brand. This comes in the form of cooking, drinks, blogs, YouTube channels, and of course the Trill titled albums. I am sure Bun B is invested in securities like stocks and bonds. In interviews, he typically mentions his work for long-term growth off-screen. More recently, he has talked about his excitement into the metaverse, crypto, and NFTs. Sure enough, we do know he is well diverse to continue to make strides in life. One thing I wanted to add to this video is that Bun B is a professor at Rice University located in Houston, Texas. He teaches the course Religious Studies 331, Religion and Hip Hop Culture. Students in the class have reached over 200 per lecture. In a 2021 interview, Bun B mentioned turning down six figures to perform on campus every year to keep intact the integrity of his course. I think this is awesome and a great example of hip hop impacting the outside world. This leads me to the question, what is next for Bun B? He is independent, which is great for him as he continues to release music. He is an awesome feature to have, so I'm sure we will see more of that too. As for investments, I think we will continue to see more routes open up with the Trill brand. He is taking Trill Burgers the right way by building up the word of mouth through pop-up shops while consistently increasing their presence. I do believe he is invested in other ventures outside the Trill brand. He is known to do work 
behind the scenes. What's coming next for Bun B? Continue success and keeping it trail. In summary, Bun B rose to the legendary status alongside the late and great Pimp C. The massive following of UGK provided multiple opportunities to grow outside of music. The trail brand is well established with the fan base and Bun B takes the proper steps to bring in others through quality. One of my favorite moments with Bun B was his album with Static Selecta, Trill Static. Bun B has built up the Trill brand to set himself up to be financially free. And that is how Bun B became financially free. I hope you found this video informational. If you did, please leave a like and subscribe as well as let me know what I should talk about next. Thank you for watching and have a great day.